To add an IEC 60870-5-104 slave, first right-click on Gateway, and since 104 slaves are always over TCP IP, select Add TCP Channel. Next, select the session protocol, in this case, S104 for slave 104. Set the IP address. This is the address of the device that the slave will connect to. In our example, we'll use the loopback address of 127.0.0.1. Select the mode, a slave should be a server, and the IP port number. The IEC 60870-5-104 specification specifies that the standard IP port number is 2404. Next, enter an alias name. And say OK. This opens the session window. You can change the values of T1, T2, T3, or the K and W values. In this example, we'll use the defaults. And finally, a sector window opens in which you can set the sector address or the ASDU address. In this case, we'll take the default of three. Finally, you can add data types if you wish. In this example, let's add a single point information. And then we can add additional data types by expanding out to the sector, right clicking and saying add data types. So let's add some additional data types.